Hello, my beautiful DNZ superfans. Oh, how on a day, this wonderful 20th day of May 2024. All right, though, we brought you news before that the Oni of Ife is celebrating her daughter, his daughter's birthday, Princess Adiola. You know, and for the birthday, the Oni has now mandated none other but Queen Naomi to make sure he helps. Uh, uh, princess Adiola to get a husband. Hey, hey, that is the instruction, direct order and instruction no, from the Oni of Ife that uh, Queen Naomi should help Queen Princess Adiola to get a husband. As a matter of fact, the palace recently has been preparing for the arrival of Queen Naomi back to the palace. And now she never even come or they don't begin to keep assignments upon assignments for her. Unlike all the other wives who have been there for a very long time, nobody send them, nobody gives them assignments. But right now, as Queen Naomi plan to return, now only don't call and today will be 20 at last. Say, ah, do you know today is your stepdaughter's birthday? And she is now 30. And at the age of 30, she's supposed to begin to make plans to go to the husband's house she's not going to the palace again yeah she can't she could be visiting but this time around she's going to be visiting as someone else you know not as person with the palace two for seven so now the only has actually given direct instructions to queen naomi that please naomi i want you to get me a husband for your stepdaughter this husband you're getting for her must be now only even went ahead as bringing out a lot of qualities that the person must possess. He said, first of all, the person must be a, a educated, that the daughter cannot marry someone who is not educated. That because what has actually been causing a lot of issues that we're having in the palace is because lack of education from most people around him. So therefore, one of the criteria that he has is that the husband that Naomi is going to help him get must be highly, highly educated. So he also went ahead to say, the person will be somebody who works in um, under minimal supervision you know as the as a, 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 a in-law of the palace you need someone who is very intelligent someone who is very sharp someone very smart someone who is very apt you know someone who's also going to do things not because mm -hmm. they've been asked to do it but needs to do things because this is the thing the right thing that should be done the only went ahead to tell naomi that just the way naomi has been a very good woman now that is exactly how he only of if he wants adiola's um, husband to be as adiola's husband is not going to be a reverse of what naomi is because just as you could imagine all these years that naomi and only have been having issues naomi wants to go his way but only has still been pushing 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 putting so much effort to make sure that he remains steadfast with the wife but others if it was others now i'm sure they could have gone with the plan not to come back again so therefore with the way the issue is right now the only officer said he wants someone that can be very reliable and from his own perspective the only person that has the temerity to do such things for him is none other but the wonderful queen naomi that is why naomi has been given this wonderful wonderful job and opportunity to make sure that she provides a good husband for princess adiola you see this is what i always talk about having to add value in your life and in your system if naomi is not such that she's adding value only will not even send her what concerns only to now tell her okay my, my dear come or come and say i can help me to get a husband for uh, my daughter but see what has happened now he now took turn to make sure that he gets a daughter a, a husband for the only's uh, uh, um, daughter and now tomorrow people begin to say that the only does not value naomi the only loves and values naomi so much it's just all these enemies of progress who have been pushing 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 putting effort to make sure and see that the only does not continue to live with the wife but guess what god will shame all of them god is going to shame all of them because the way it is right now naomi is coming back to the power whether i like it or not and you know people have been trying to see that naomi and adiola quarrels they've been trying to need so many efforts to see that they quarrel but guess what god has already shamed them because the relationship between these two is going to get going to work stronger and stronger stronger and stronger imagine now that now may now finally come and get a husband for adiola imagine what's going to happen it will make their bond stronger 
and the royal family is going to come back to what it used to be again all right people thank you so so much please do well to subscribe to our channel click the notification button comment like and share and if there's just anything you want to talk about in this channel do not hesitate to let us know guess what we will talk about it all right thank you and god bless you all bye bye